an East Coast filmmaker, and you've you've received a very prestigious award. Um, tell me, will that help the Eastern industry or you? It'll help me. <laughs> I don't know if it's going to help the East Coast industry, um, but it's a great acknowledgement. We make great work out there, and uh, the resources are slim. So you know, I'd like to think that it would help, but uh, the rea reality is, you know, we we tend to work with. Uh, limited budgets, and you know, but we gr make great work. We got stories to tell there. You know, there's more. There's, there's a lot of hardship there, and you know, people with interesting perspectives. There's a lot going on in the film industry right now regarding micro budgets or smaller films. And do you think that's really helping films like yours get to the screen? Uh, no. Okay. Yeah, I mean, I I think. That's honest. Yeah, yeah, I think micro budgets, like what is being defined as micro budgets. Uh, in this country right now is you know roughly about one tenth of the budget of Blackbird. It's really uh, you know I, and people making their first films are now given such little resources to make their first features. It's so 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 hard. Um, 1.25 million was the budget of Blackbird, and that that was really hard to pull off the film to execute the script at that budget. So. You know, the Michael Budget Program, I mean, you can do great things now with the technology, but it, it, to me it seems like we're going to relegate, we're, it's, it's, just, it's just more difficult for emerging filmmakers than it was in the past. Wow, that's very interesting to me. Well, congratulations on your win, and we so are pleased because it's Blackbird and we love Blackbird, so congratulations. Thanks a lot.